morning church we are at the end of the first John and we're chapter 5 and verse 18 to the end and these this section to me is the we know section uh, there's three we knows so let's go through those verse 18 we know that anyone born of God does not continue to sin that the one who is born of God keeps him safe and the evil one cannot harm him. So we know we're not going to live in sin when we've been born of God. Number two, we know that we are children of God and that the whole world is under the control of the evil one. So we know we're God's children. But we also know that the world is screwed up. We are not children of this world. We are children of God. Verse 20. We know also that the Son of God has come and has given us understanding so that we may know Him who is true. And we are in Him who is true, even in His Son, Jesus Christ. He is the true God and, et and eternal life. So we know that we're children of God. We know this world is run by someone else, Satan. And we know that we know who God is. He's given us understanding. We know that he's true and that he's eternal life. And we're in him. When we're in him, we're safe. The same way when Moses was a child and his mother put him in a basket and sent him down the Nile. The Nile was full of crocodiles, alligators, whichever it is. He was dead meat, but he was being protected in that ark in God. Speaking of an ark, you got way back when, during the flood, uh, Noah and family were protected inside that ark. Both of those things are shadows of the truth. Those are They're true, but they're shadows of the truth the big truth that we're in Christ and when we're in him we're protected when we're in him we're in the family uh, we go back to that Ephesians 1 we're blessed we're chosen accepted adopted forgiven and redeemed we've become part of the family we're accepted we're adopted things we've done is have been forgiven so in him we are all these things. All God's people said, Amen.